Hello everybody! I am Nert and welcome back once again to the cat lady. Dr. X is an ass, Dr. X is a dick, he's a murderer, he stabbed us in multiple organs. And we shall continue to see what's going on. Let's pull this cord, I guess. Oh, let's shut the music up. Oh god, hi I. Who... who are you? I am the crow, of course. Cool, can you stop croaking or croaking or whatever the fuck it's called? Squawking, we'll say squawking. I thought so. There are two doors leading out of this place. One of them will simply take Susan back to where she belongs. But behind the other one, there is a great reward for her. Okay. It's something she always wanted. Something she longs for every single day. Is it sushi? Where are no. those doors? Okay. I can't see them. Just walk back to the right side of the stage. Is it sushi? It no. So over here? There's a there I found them. Ah oh, no. 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 No, she doesn't. Oh my- no. No, she doesn't. Whatever they are, tell them to stop staring. But they are yet to guide, Susan. They are the guardians of the doors. They know which door she should enter to get the rewards. But there is one problem. There's always a problem. Always, I'm not apparently. even surprised. Which door should I go through? I will leave that to Susan's own best judgment. But this might be her only chance to find what she had lost. Waste it. And Susan will never get it back. Susan has one question. And she can only ask one of them. She must use it wisely. Fine. I can do oh, that. I hate but these. What's the catch? It's very simple. One of my girls always tells the truth. While the other one always lies. And okay. I'm guessing you can't tell me which is which? It's something I've forgotten myself a long time ago, Susan. But does it really matter? Yeah, it My does. My question is all Susan needs to find the right door. Oh, God. Alright. So which door should I enter? Which door will lead me, me, lead me to my reward? Which door will lead me back to my world? Is the door on the left the one I should open? Is the door on the right the one I should open? Which door would the other doll point me to? Is the other doll a liar? If I enter the left door, will I get the reward? If I, which door would you enter to get the reward? Which door should I not enter? I'm assuming it's the same for the other one. So... Which door would the other doll point me to? Which door would the other doll point me to? So the other one would point me to the left one. And I cannot ask you a question. Okay. So you know what? Or to point me to the right one. No, fuck you. I'm going to the left one. I'm assuming. Is, is this supposed to be my reward? Flowers. I hate flowers. You lied to me. You lied. Flowers. Take. I see a big eyeball. Precious waiting for you here. Look at the lovely roses. They really are. Just like everything else in the room. They just turn into ash. Okay. What does this do for me? Oh, there's another door. Enter. I'm back in the house. Oh, do I get to blow out another- Uh, I don't want to blow out another candle after last time. Okay, blow out. Um. Um. Hi. I don't know who this is. This isn't me. You're about to flatline, aren't you?
Oh, someone just flatlined in a hospital. Oh, that sound. Uh-uh. Oh. Can we not with the sound? Body bag? Open. If it stops the sound, open it. It fell. Body bag. B body bag. Open. <laughs> Elevator down. Is it me again? <gasps> it's me again. I was kidding about the mortality, but I guess it- Oh god, I really am immortal. <coughs> Susan, sweetheart, I know you just died, but I'm gonna need you to calm them you tits, okay? You treacherous, dirty bastard. Tell them all. I opened my heart to you, and you stabbed me to death in cold blood. You'll pay for this. I swear you will. But this means the old woman was right. I can't die. I'm immortal. I think it's time to find out how very mortal you are, Doctor. So the Doctor is one of the first like, suicide note. Read. My name is Su this is my this is Susan's suicide note. My name is Susan Ashworth. I live alone in this old two-bedroom flat. I rarely go outside. Okay. Well, you have something. Yeah, I want this. Give me this. Thank you. I'm so sorry I had to take it out of your body, but, you know. Uh, can I open the- just open the door? Okay! I pull Someone's not having a fun time! Oh. My. God. Yes, let's just zoom in on that. Th th thank you. It seen- It- I've seen something like this before, the living painting. Except- this here is a dead body suspended on wires and tied to a chair? Oh my god, Doctor is a fucking sicko. Why are you backing up, Susan? You're gonna pay for this, you bastard. Yes, he is, but we, we, we need to see what the screaming is first. Mona- oh my fucking god. Oh god. Oh god. I don't need oh, eyes to enjoy your fear. Scream louder, little bitch. Scream your lungs out. Louder, I said. <laughs> yes, this is by far my favorite of songs. Would you like me to dance for you? Unlike you. I know all art needs to be appreciated. Your scream is like a poem without words. What? He, he's wearing a mask and a blindfold. He's convinced I'm dead and no one knows about this place. Well, looks like you, you just made a big mistake, you arrogant asshole. Your body. An instrument. I never thought you had it in you. And yet you make every fiber in my body tremble with excitement. Your body will forever be admired by those like me who understand the only pure and true form of art. What the fuck are you doing? Oh, can I leave now? Oh my fucking god. Well. Remember when we talked to the lady? We're killing his ass. I'm telling you that now. He, he's dying. Ooh, a wrench. Thank you. I will take that. Uh, examine. Oh my god, her limp body is positioned the exact same as the painting. Seems the killer used wires to keep her head tilted to the side. No, I don't want to do that. Venus. I look at her hand. We oh, have a ring. Can I use the wrench? 
Um, I could pull off, I could pull it off if the finger weren't so swollen and stiff. Does this do anything? Okay, no. Okay, it was worth a shot. Uh, enter? Okay, so we can go in here. Skeleton! A fake skeleton. It has probably been used for teaching before it ended up here. Okay. Bolt. I'll take the bolt, I guess. Thank you. Uh, an easel. No, I keep hitting the wrong button. Uh, the doctor probably considers himself quite an artist. Uh, do I throw shit on? I'm assuming I put this on the workbench. Uh, doing. No, okay. Uh, return to room. Okay. So I'm assuming we don't technically have a weapon, so I'm guessing we have to make some form of a, of a weapon. Salmon. Okay, yeah, I've already looked at that. Okay. Let's... Let's go to... Uh... <laughs> Thank you, I hate it. Soap. Oh, can I... Uh, run cold water. Uh, use. Can I use the turn the tap off? Can I use this on the 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 swollen? I want to go over here first. Oh my god! Examine the doll. Uh, I guess we couldn't. Oh my fuck! Take doll head. Probably fun. Oh, we took the doll head. I don't want it. Danger sign. Door. Liz? God, it's Liz. <laughs> it's impossible. I spoke to her last night. I tried to stop her from jumping, and yet here she is stuck on a metal rod, looking like she's been dead for a lot longer than that. What happened then? Was it just a dream? Am I really going crazy, or was she really there, just already dead? Take her down. Just, just let her. Just get her down. No, take her down. Why can I not? Oh, there's a key right here. <laughs> I'm more focused on fucking Liz. Let me. Can I take her down? Uh, I hope at least she'll find some peace and death. Oh, I'm sorry, Liz. All right, so we have a key. I don't want to go here. All right, let me go see if I can get the—I guess—the ring off her finger for some for some reason. Um, I hit the wrong button yet again. Wet soap. Geez. Cool. Now we have that. I don't know what that does for us. So, let's use the workbench. Can I use the ba the doll head for anything? No. Um. I have a second iron bar now. Can I put the nut on it? I cannot. Can I put the bolt on it? I can. Uh, so now the bolt goes on to help hold it together. Or the nut. And then I can tighten it with the wrench. Oh, that's it? So what's the point of the key? Oh, is this like the exit key, I'm guessing? I keep hitting the wrong button, I'm not even gonna lie. Alright, then what's the point of me having the baby head? Alright, fuck it. Let's go, let's, let's go shank a doctor, I guess. Spear use. Um, you'll feel a sharp scratch. <laughs> I don't know what that's from, but okay. What's up, Doc? Do you believe in karma, Doc? See you in hell? Say nothing. I like the Bugs Bunny. What's up, Doc? Yeah, fuck you. Payback's a bitch, isn't it? Bastard. Alright, let's untie her. Let's get, let's get her out of here. Untie. Untie. 
Thank you. Thank you so much. He would have... He would have killed me. Like the others. The animal. You, you gave him what he deserved. Who are you? They call me the cat lady. Fuck everything else. They call me the cat lady. Now get out of here. Call the police. I'm going home. Finally, Susan is going home. And we are rolling right into chapter three. Well, I have no regrets of killing Dr. X. River. Damn creepy bastard deserved it, apparently. Standing by the river, I wonder. Do I need a stone? I don't know, do you? No. My heart is heavy enough. It will drag me down for sure. Okay. It's a river. I don't know if y'all notice that, but it's it's it, it's a river. It's a big ass river, but it's a river. Hotel. I'm assuming this is where we live. I'm covered in blood. Finally, I'm back home. I'll be safe here. First of all, I should wash off all this all the horrid memories of this night. I'm dying for a shower, something to eat, some coffee, and a cigarette. I'd love to see my cats too. Let's just pretend for a moment that everything is back to normal. I survived after all, maybe now I can try to enjoy little things in life. I didn't even read what that was. Alright, let's turn that off. Um, open the bathroom. Let's go in the bathroom. Turn on the light switch. Take a shower. Oh! Great, must have run out of money on, in, on the electric meter. Um, I can't take a shower in the dark. I mean, you could if you have flashlights. Uh, there should be money in the bedroom. Oh. Uh, what? Red gauge shows Susan's mental status. It, get, it goes up whenever she's upset. When it fills up, she will suffer a complete breakdown. Alright, so let's not... Do that. Okay, let's get some money in the meter. So, I think it's in the bedroom, so we gotta go into the bedroom, which is gonna be this one. Let's do that. Uh, bag. I'm assuming the money is going to be in the bag. Some loose change inside. What's this? What? Bills, bills, mm. bills, and more bills. How can I afford to pay these? I wish I'd never got out of that hospital alive. Alright. Oh, I didn't want to actually look at the bills. Um, Alright, let's go throw money in the meter. Um, let's not, please. Oh, uh, Susan's getting very irritated. <laughs> Let's not um, open the door. And we're gonna throw the change in the meter. That should last a few days for her to switch off the lights when I leave the room. Okay. Blue gauge goes up when Susan is happy and satisfied. When it fills, she will be able to relax and get some rest. Alright, so let us... It's already open. <laughs> I meant to hit enter. Alright, so let's take a shower, I guess. Take a shower. Get all the blood off. That mirror is crooked and it is bothering me. Standing by the river, I smile. Will I miss it all? No. 
I'll be glad to leave it behind and never come back. That feels better now. I should grab some food. When was the last time I ate? I'm starving. Alrighty. Oh, wait. Let's turn the light off in the bathroom. Let's go in the kitchen. Turn on the lights. Uh. Uh. Go and fill up the kettle with some water. Alright, I can't make coffee because I don't actually have the... Hey, coffee! I should make a coffee first. Oh. Oh, that's... Uh, I'll take the matches. I'll take the cat food. Um, I don't... I don't need it right yeah, now. Yeah, I don't know why I would... I don't know why you would either. Um... Oh, fridge. Open. Um, let's take the cheeseburger. I don't need the milk right now for anything. Alright, how long do I need to... Cheese, cooking instructions, roof package, place in microwave oven. 60 seconds. Wait. Oh, yeah. Examine. 800 watt microwave. Okay, oh, microwave. It's a microwave! Um, 800 was 60 seconds. Okay, so, no, 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 no. This, this. 60 seconds. Eat the burger. Eat the burger. Yeah! Satisfaction. Okay, make coffee. I need an empty mug. Of course you do! Open. So there is no mug in this kitchen. Why is there no mug in the kitchen? There's a piano. No, I didn't want to sit in the chair. I actually wanted to go out on the balcony. Balcony door, enter. Laundry rack, mug! Take. Thank you for the mug. So let's head back to the kitchen and make some candy. Kettle, make coffee. Need to boil the water for switch on. That's a lot of steam. Kettle, make coffee. Uh, I did not even read what that was. So can I use this now? Now it's a perfect mug of coffee. And now Susan is satisfied. So let's go out on the, uh, the whatchamacallit, I guess, the, the balcony. Enter balcony, and turn. this damn bird again. Go away! Shoo! Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Uh, examine. I used to hang clothes here to dry when the weather was good. It's broken now like everything else in the same flat. Okay. So we have to get rid of the bird. Damn crow. Oh, uh, let's shut the window so... Yeah. Let's enter the spare bedroom. I thought I put it away, damn thing, I wish it could just disappear, but here it is, reminding me of the past. Oh. I shouldn't have come in here. Um, there's absolutely nothing in here I need, I shouldn't have even bothered coming in here. Open. This damn ball falls at the shelf every time I open the door. Wait, did I pick up the ball? I did.
Uh, shut the window. That's not it. Cat clock. I don't know what to do. Examine. Don't need any of these. Okay. So, can I put the ball on the laundry rack and make like a. I can. I need more shit. I'm assuming I can get the hat. Turn the. That way it's not as dark. So I'm assuming I can take the hat. Uh, is there anything else in here that I need? I don't think so. Let's go ahead and turn off the light in there. Hmm. Uh, let's make it bright in here. Cabinet examine. No cabinet where I keep books, mail, magazines, and wine glasses. I can't remember the last time I used these. Um, I haven't had a drink since Eric. What is the fucking thing with Eric? Can I give you the hat and we're good? Is that all we need? Are you terrified of that? No, you're not. Hmm. Something is still missing. Apparently. What is missing? Hmm. Nothing else in the closet that I need. Is there anything else in the bag that I need? No. I don't know what to do. I, I, I don't know what to do. I guess I'll be back once I figure out what to do. Oh, in the spare bedroom, there's apparently a shirt that I can take. But all that's in here. Okay. So, let's head back. Wait, again, wrong button. Go down, go down! Do you need to be closer? Does that do it? There we go. That's right. And don't ever come back, you horrible creature. Miss Scarecrow here is going to guard this home from the likes of you. There we go. I'm back in my old life. But how can I restore what's been broken for years? So far, nothing seems to go right. Every little thing is against me. Maybe it's my destiny to lose after all. And now those parasites? Like if it wasn't enough, but I killed Dr. X. And I saved somebody's life. I mean, he was an insane That bastard. felt good. It's getting late. I should summon the cats now. I want to see them tonight. Okay, so cat time. Oh, back to the river. Standing by the river, I close my eyes. One jump, and I'm there. No, someone jumped after me. He will never be my friend. Cats always pay a visit when I play the piano. It's really late, but I don't really care. Okay, so we play the piano.
Get it, Susan? The animation of the cat just jumping. <laughs> Inside, my darlings. I've missed you. Oh, who's yeah. that? Teacup. I bet you thought you'd never see me again. Well, make yourselves at home. Dinner is ready to be served. Let's put the cat food in the bowl. Come on, everybody. Gather around. It's time for dinner. The happy cat eating. Happy cat. Happy cat. No, look at the key. No. Happy cat. You never eat my food, teacup. Already had your dinner, have you? No. No, I get it. I know. You're a good friend. The best friend I have, really. The only friend in the whole fucking world. Oh. You come over to keep me company and want nothing in return. I appreciate it. No, they want you pets, should know. as they deserve. If you could know what I've been through lately. I've been to hell and back, my boy. But I'm here now. In my flat. Alive. And it's still the same mess that it's always been. I'm not sure how to deal with all this anymore. Don't know if I can. I wish I could be like you. At peace with the world. Always smiling. Someone's at the door. Oh, Jesus. But who could it be so late at night? What? Can I just, like, not answer it? I guess I kind of have to, huh? What? What do you want? Are you out of your mind? Do you know what time it is? We've all had it with you and your bloody cats. Oh, that arm, though. Just uh, What are you talking about? It's just you change your tone. Sure. I suggest you change your tone right now. Don't tell me about my tone. I'll have any tone I like. Watch if it's alright for you to play the fucking piano in the middle of the night, then I can bloody raise my voice if I want to. You think you own this place? You think any of us here care about your stinking cats? They are a bloody nuisance! I'm gonna keep mice away. Uh... Don't Get lost, you bald ugly man. I'm done talking to you. What?! How dare you?! Watch this me. is going to stop! One way or the other, you crazy cat lady! If this happens again, you'll see pest control stepping in, and it won't be pretty! Hell, I'll poison your fucking cats myself if I have to! Point that finger at me again, and I will break it. I'm done talking to you. Go fuck yourself. Woo! Oh no, Susan. Just, just take a breath. Just, 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 just go pet teacup. Oh, I, I'm not, I can't move. I straight cannot, there it goes. I'm not moving. I am not moving. Drink your coffee. We'll, we'll, go, we'll go to bed. We, we, go, we gonna be good. We gonna, we, we gonna be gold stars. We gonna be good. We'll play the piano some more, piss them off. Fuck that man. The window. No, it's okay. Let's let's not. Oh. 
cat. Standing by the river, I'm thinking. Will I jump again? No. Behind the closed doors, I have fallen in love with the razor. Chapter four. I honestly did not read what that was. I, I blanked out for a second. <laughs> Control bastard. Uh, what? I'm assuming those are legs. They, look, they honestly look like, like stumps or something, like trunk of a tree or something. Did you kill a sapling? Um. Uh... Okay. That was he was wearing a gas mask. Yes, Susan. I've slept all night and most of the day. Good. Why am I still feeling tired? Because no matter how much sleep we get, we're always going to be tired. Someone's at the door. I really hope it's not him again. You know what? We're going to end this episode here and we'll answer the door in the next one. So thank y'all so much for watching and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye!